Academy second grade. We're here at my house, that's right, Mr. Scharnberg's house, to study fish and the life cycle of fish. As you can tell, I like fish and I keep a lot of them. These are seven, actually six of my seven fish tanks. All right, so we're gonna check these out and look at the life cycle of fish. Let's start out with some baby fish. These are some young fish right here. That is the mommy. And she's bringing her fish out for dinner. We're gonna get a close up on her. There we go, there are the bunch of little babies. It's hard to keep focus on them. She's taking them out to eat dinner. She's there, up oh, there's the daddy, the bigger one. That's the daddy, he's guarding to make sure no other fish bother them. They may be a little afraid of these pencil fish up here. Okay, but they're not, these pencil fish aren't going to hurt them. But these fish, but the mommy and daddy, Crebenzis cichlids from Cameroon are not taking any chances. See, there's daddy. Garden up top, he's like, what is this camera doing here? Come on now, what are you guys doing? So these fish are t checking everything out. So these fish take their babies around to feed them. They are very loving and protective parents. These fish are, these little babies are about a week old. Yep, they're pretty youngins, the little whippersnappers. But they feed off of little pieces of small food. Oh, and what are you doing? What's this little guy? Oh, you better catch up. Oh, there's mommy. She says, get over there. What are you doing? Get over there. See the little baby's like, but mommy, what am I do? Get over with the rest of them, kid. All right, let's, all right, now we're going to check out some other fish. Back up top here, this is a pregnant fish. She is a swordtail. They're called swordtails because the males, like this one, have a sword on their tail right there. So she is pregnant. And you can see that little black spot in front of her stomach right there. She's going to have babies soon. So she is going to be a mommy fish. But they haven't had babies yet. These are babies from about, uh, these are about five months old. So that's going to be little girl. And that may be a boy, I don't know. Checking these guys out. These fish give birth to live young, while these fish down here lay eggs. So they hatch out of eggs. That's two different types of ways of having babies. Egg laying eggs, and they lay them in a little cave back, back in there, back around there is a little cave. And these guys can have their babies wherever they want. Let's check out some other fish. So we have pregnant fish, baby fish down here. All right. We have fit young fish. These fish are about four to five months old. These are the same species of fish, but from a different part of Cameroon. These are Crebenzis cichlids, and they're from the Lakunji River in Cameroon. These guys are from the area of Mayuka. There they go. They're from the area of Mayuka. Are the same are the same species of fish, but these guys are not adults yet. They're only about an inch long. So this is the next cycle of young fish, okay? They're out here trying to get food. So these little guys, that is a young boy. That's a young girl right there. So these guys are about four months in human time. They're probably, that means they're probably about 10 or 12 years old in fish years. So they're just, they're still young. These other little fish are called checker barbs and they're pretty young too. They're only probably about three months old as well. And this is where they live. 
we have a young pair of fish that are probably about 16 years old in fish years. These guys are the same type of fish we've seen before, but they're from a different part of the country, so that's why I like them. They're not, they're almost ready to have babies, so they're still hanging out together. The bigger fish, that's the boy, and that's the female right there. All right, so these guys are almost adults. They almost will get married, but they're not quite ready yet. And this is where they live. What fish need to do is that the male needs to try to get the female to like him. That is a male, and that is a female, and she doesn't really like the boy yet to have babies. But he's trying. That's why he's so brightly colored, and he's chasing the female around the tank. She's like, get away from me. You smell. You're ugly. Well, maybe give him about... I'd say a month or two, and they may be mommy and daddy fish. But right now, that boy with the bright orange fins isn't getting any luck. And this is where they live. This is another female right here of a different type from Cameroon. She's a little bit pregnant. She's got some eggs, but she's not going to have babies yet. And she's like, what is that finger doing? What are you doing? But she's really pretty because she wants to have babies. All right. Now the, 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 the daddy fish or the male fish is back in there somewhere. Next, we're going to look at some Siamese fighting fish. That is what you get at the pet store. They have long fins. Some have short fins like this koi type betta. But all bettas start first with this nest. Male bettas make a nest of bubbles, just like this one did. That means the male betta wants to find a female so he can have babies. The female lays eggs and then they spit the eggs up into this bubble nest. So that's how this life cycle starts first. The male betta builds a nest of bubbles and then a female comes underneath and she lays the eggs in the air and then they spit the bubble, they spit the eggs up in the bubbles. All right, second grade, that's sort of how the life cycles. We have little baby fish to start. Those are babies. That's the first part. Mommy checking them out. Then we have young fish let's back this up here all right come on we have got young fish right here well, let me move my there we go we have young fish that's the next stage and then we have oh they've gone hiding again all right then we have some fish that are going to be mommy and daddy fi oh there she is all right, then we have some fish that are gonna be mommy and daddy soon. And then we have another family. All right, so there you have it.